I'm going to show you how to wind your bobbin and thread your sewing machine. So the machine that I'm using is a Janome 525S, but the principles are pretty much the same on any machine that you're going to use, so it should be helpful. So the first thing I'm going to do is take my spool of thread and put it onto the spool pin. And then I'm going to secure it with my spool holder. I've got two with this machine, um, a small and a large, and you just need to choose the one that's appropriate for the size spool that you're using. So in this instance I'm going to use a small one and I'm going to pop it on the end there to secure my lovely pink thread. Then I'm going to take the thread around this bobbin winding catcher there to make sure it's in place. And then I'm going to thread the thread into my bobbin, into one of the holes at the edge of the bobbin, um, like that. Okay, so thread is through. The next thing is to put my bobbin onto this pin here. You hear it click into place. And then if I press it to the right, you can hear it. It moves over and it engages. Um, the next step is to disengage the needle. Now, I wound a bobbin just recently, so I need to press it in to show you. You pull it out to disengage the needle. So this needs to be out. So now we're ready to wind the bobbin. I'm going to put my foot on the pedal and off we go. And you can see there that the bobbin is filling up. So when you've got enough thread on your bobbin, you just stop, click it back away and engage your needle. And that's it. Thank you.